Hey guys, Kristen Cronin here, Director of Education for Active Motion Bar. Today we're going to go through some core progressions. These are inspired by Leslie Bender, my really good friend and mentor, so we actually are going to use the Bender Ball today. So I'm going to have Shelby. We're also using the um, three pound bar, which is a new product for us, which is great. It fits really well with Pilates um, and creates really nice challenges within different levers. So we're going to have um, Shelby go ahead and bend her knees and place her feet onto the floor. I'm going to take the ball and use it at the low back kind of sacrum area at the hip to stabilize her as she moves through these sequences. It's really nice and safe and allows her to anchor through there. So you're going to go ahead and take the ball into or the bar into the hands. We're going to bring it to the bar to body position here. So to creating a more assessment based move, we're going to float the active resistance in the center. So you can feel it shifting. It will shift a little bit. But we're going to try to stabilize it here. So nice and tall, sit up tall, drawing the abs in. Use your breath as you inhale, hinge back to your point of control. Good, not crushing the ball, and then we're just going to move away from it. So we're starting to fire up our core. We have a short lever. It's a nice progression here. So to progress this exercise, we're going to come all the way back up, extend the arms out, creating a longer lever, wrapping the shoulders into the back. So lift the heart, lift the sternum here. Perfect. Now you're going to inhale back and exhale lift. Again, we're still keeping the active resistance inside of the bar floating in the center, trying to stabilize it and keeping it quiet. So starting to create a longer lever, more challenge. As you go back, I want you to lift the arms overhead, lengthening up. Go ahead, wrap the shoulders into the back, and then lift. Perfect. We're going to hold back there. Yes, the abs are shaking. And then we're just going to create a little overhead flexion here, or a little lateral flexion through the spine. Perfect. So you have to counter stabilize here as the active resistance hits at the end of the bar. Good. We're going to bring it back to center and come back up. Extend the arms out. Now as we hinge back, we're going to create a tip and tilt pattern with an arc here. So we're going to hinge back to your point of control, arcing through the bar, just like you're paddling a, a boat, a kayak. Good. And again, creating that rhythm as the active resistance shifts inside of the bar. So using your breath, Closing down through the obliques, like really squeeze and hug it in. Good. Last one. Good. Come into center and then rest it down. Perfect. Thanks.